Tomorrow morning when you wake up, you'll likely see yet another gray and gloomy sky. It has become mm. a familiar sight, with many San Diegans wondering what happened to our famous sunshine. CBS 8's Jasmine Ramirez looks into what's playing into these cloudy conditions. Jasmine. We're familiar with May gray and June gloom. Now we have another term. This cloudy and gray April is being referred to as grapeful. Sunny San Diego hasn't been so sunny recently. And the weather's been uh, really bad here lately. It's a little sad and gloomy, you know. Travis Looney has never seen a spring in San Diego quite like this. Lived here for about seven years now, and I'm like, I feel like I pay way too much in sunshine taxes to, <laughs> to have to deal with Portland weather almost. So what's causing the grapeful gloom? It's a prelude to the May gray, um, and I think we're seeing it uh, more common this year. The the sea surface temperatures, the ocean waters near record cold levels, and that's causing more gray for us. Dan Gregoria is a meteorologist for the National Weather Service. I asked if these conditions will cause May and June to be gloomier than typical years. I think so. Yeah, typically that's our peak in the cloud cover, that marine layer deck near the coast. And I think we're going to see a lot of days of that here, May and even into June. People visiting San Diego say they're still making the best of their time here despite the overcast skies. It's still very beautiful. Um, I, I flew in for Coachella this weekend, um, but I, it's, it's been great. It's just a little, a little cold. And I do have some good news. I'm told we can expect to see less cloud coverage and more sunshine later this week. Jasmine Ramirez, CBS 8.